Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. Welcome to Bagel Gym. When Ray and Sidney Braswell come to games now, it's strictly to be fans. But when Dr. Ray Braswell came to Denton ISD in 1979, his role was quite a bit different. I was a uh, biology teacher uh, along with the uh, athletic trainer. Being a trainer was what I always wanted to do. Uh, I enjoyed sports. I never was big enough really to play, and so this was the way I could be around it. He understood the sports. He understood injuries. He's the only trainer I have ever seen in my life that could tear Elasticon, which is an, an incredibly, by hand, which is an incredibly thick, sturdy tape. And he did it one time, I'm going, whoa, <laughs> let's not make Dr. Braswell mad. <laughs> but Dr. Braswell wasn't ripping tape with his bare hands for long. Soon, he would move up the campus administrative ladder and then into central administration. Before long, the guy that came to Denton ISD as an athletic trainer was the superintendent. Sometimes the job finds you. You don't go find the job. And that's, that's basically what happened to me. I had a great staff. And I had great people uh, occupying uh, the board of trustees. Uh, those two things made the job be what the job was. It made it fun to come to work. The results of that work can be seen all over our district. Dr. Braswell was superintendent for 14 years. During that time, 20 schools and four district facilities were built. These additions made the school day more comfortable, made it easier for students to learn a trade, and made games feel bigger. It was a lively time, and one Dr. Braswell remembers fondly. I never felt overwhelmed. Uh, I never felt like it was all about one person taking care of it. I had a, a great administrative team, great uh, school board. We just, we would take one project, work it through. The next day we would focus, I mean, it was just methodical. Of all the things we did, starting, building, starting the building of schools out here on 380, was one of the most important. You had all these different little communities that I'm proud to say the school system has brought together and the high school was the final piece. I was like, dang, that's a big high school. It's amazing, yeah, it, it is amazing. It's just unbelievable every time you walk through those doors. I thought it was really nice. I had expectations for it to be really cool. When we built Geyer, I thought, wow, I don't think I'd ever see anything again like this, and, and lo and behold, here we are. Where we are is a beautiful school that has everything a student can need. Learning is not just confined to the classroom at Braswell. This is a high-tech campus where students get to learn in non-traditional spaces. All of that helps these students build their own thing at Braswell, and they are very excited about it. So many of our kids today, school is the most uh, important thing in their day. It's a place that's safe during the day, they can be involved in things, they have friends here, they've got mentors with the staff and everyone. So it's just a great security for this community. It definitely feels like ours, with all the students and teachers, we all feel like connected and unified and I like that and that's something I haven't experienced yet until I came here. It's been actually really fun to actually say that you're making a school yours and it's brand new and you get to make traditions and everything and have new teachers and new friends. It's really good. It's a good social. I feel like we actually get to like influence the way the school is going to be for years to come instead of just going into a school and having to kind of follow what's been done already. The Braswells get to see those traditions being made with their own eyes, which is a lot to handle, even for the man that has seen almost everything there is to see in education. I have a hard time wearing jackets with the name. I wear the bingo. I'm very proud of the bingo, but it's, that's just not who I am. And, uh, but we're so proud of the opportunity. It's an incredible honor, uh, one that uh, we will be forever grateful never take for granted and then our promise was it's one that we'll try to continue to earn 
by supporting the school. We want them to uh, have great accomplishment, uh, be prepared for life, be prepared for the future, and we want them to know that we're going to be here to, to back them up, to support them.